Today, we'll be delving into the fascinating origins and evolution of horse-drawn carriages. These elegant modes of transportation have gone through numerous changes in design, materials, and styles throughout history, reflecting the diverse cultures and time periods in which they were used. The concept of horse-drawn carriages dates back to ancient civilizations, such as the Egyptians, Greeks, and Romans, who used chariots for various purposes, like warfare, sports. These early carriages were typically made of wood, with wheels made of solid wood, or bound with metal for added strength. As time went on, the design of horse-drawn carriages became increasingly sophisticated. During the Middle Ages, the coach emerged in Europe, featuring an enclosed cabin mounted on a spun suspension system. This provided a more comfortable ride for passengers, especially over rough terrain. During the Renaissance, ornate carriages were often used by royalty and nobility, showcasing elaborate designs and luxurious materials, such as silk, velvet, and gold leaf. The 18th and 19th centuries brought about even more innovation in carriage design with the introduction of lighter and more maneuverable vehicles like the Phaeton, Landau, and Barouche. These carriages were typically made with a combination of wood, metal, and leather, and were often adorned with elegant upholstery and decorative details. The variety of styles available reflected the different needs and preferences of the time, from practical and utilitarian vehicles to those that exuded luxury and status. In summary, the history of horse-drawn carriages is marked by a fascinating evolution of designs, materials, and styles that have adapted to the needs and tastes of various cultures and time periods. From the ancient chariots to the opulent coaches of European royalty, these elegant vehicles have played a significant role in the history of human transportation. Now that we've explored the origins and evolution of horse-drawn carriages, let's examine the significant role they played in shaping society. These elegant vehicles had a profound impact on transportation, trade, and communication in the pre-industrial era, ultimately shaping the way people lived and interacted with one another. As the primary mode of transportation for centuries, horse-drawn carriages connected people across vast distances, enabling the exchange of goods, ideas, and culture. Trade routes were established, and economies flourished as merchants, traders, and travelers relied on carriages to transport their goods and themselves. This connectivity between cities and countries allowed for the growth and expansion of empires, as well as the dissemination of knowledge, art, and technology. In addition to facilitating trade, horse-drawn carriages also played a crucial role in communication. Before the invention of modern communication methods like the telegraph or telephone, Letters and important documents were transported by horse-drawn carriages, known as mail coaches. These vehicles ensured that vital information reached its destination in a timely manner, keeping governments, businesses, and individuals connected despite the vast distances between them. The widespread use of horse-drawn carriages also had social implications as they became a symbol of status and wealth. The more ornate and luxurious the carriage, the higher the social standing of its owner. This led to a competitive culture among the elite, with individuals commissioning custom-built carriages to showcase their wealth and taste. In conclusion, horse-drawn carriages played a pivotal role in shaping society during the pre-industrial era. Their impact on transportation trade and communication contributed to the growth and development of cities, countries, and empires, 
while also influencing social dynamics and status. These elegant vehicles were truly the driving force behind a more connected and prosperous world. Let's now take a closer look at the craftsmanship and skills involved in building and maintaining horse-drawn carriages. Constructing these elegant vehicles required a high level of expertise with various tradespeople working together to create a seamless and functional work of art. In addition, the roles of the coachman, stable hands, and horses were equally important in ensuring a smooth and comfortable ride. Creating a horse-drawn carriage was a complex process involving skilled craftsmen, such as woodworkers, blacksmiths, upholsterers, and painters. Woodworkers meticulously shaped and joined wood to create the carriage's frame and body, while blacksmiths forged metal components such as axles, springs, and wheel rims. Upholsterers were responsible for crafting the interior seats and cushions, using luxurious fabrics and materials to provide comfort and elegance. Painters added the finishing touches by applying intricate designs, family crests, or monograms to the carriage's exterior. Maintaining a horse-drawn carriage was no small feat either. Regular upkeep was essential to ensure the vehicle remained in good working condition. This involved tasks such as checking the wheels and axles for wear, adjusting the suspension system, and keeping the upholstery clean and well preserved. The coachmen played a vital role in the operation of horse-drawn carriages as they were responsible for driving and navigating the vehicle. They needed to possess exceptional horsemanship skills as well as knowledge of the local routes and terrain in addition, coachmen were often responsible for the safety and well-being of their passengers, making their role a highly respected and sought-after profession. Stable hands and grooms were also indispensable as they cared for the horses that powered the carriages. They ensured the animals were well-fed, groomed, and healthy, while also maintaining the harnesses and other equipment necessary for the carriage's operation. Finally, the horses themselves were the true stars of the show, providing the strength and grace required to pull these elegant vehicles. Different breeds were used depending on the specific needs and demands of the carriage, with some horses being better suited for speed, while others excelled in power and endurance. In conclusion, the craftsmanship and skills involved in building and maintaining horse-drawn carriages, as well as the roles of the coachmen, stable hands, and horses, were essential components in the operation of these elegant vehicles. Their combined efforts contributed to the enduring appeal and functionality of horse-drawn carriages throughout history. As we continue our journey through the history of horse-drawn carriages, it's important to understand the factors that led to their decline as a primary mode of transportation. With the advent of modern technology, such as automobiles, trains, and trams, horse-drawn carriages gradually lost their prominence in the world of transportation. The Industrial Revolution during the 18th and 19th centuries brought about significant advancements in technology and engineering. Steam-powered locomotives, for example, began to revolutionize travel, offering faster and more efficient transportation options for both passengers and goods. Railways quickly expanded, connecting cities and countries like never before. This newfound ease of travel and the increased speed at which people could move made horse-drawn carriages less practical for long distances. In the late 19th and early 20th centuries, the introduction of automobiles
further contributed to the decline of horse-drawn carriages. Cars offered even more convenience and flexibility than trains, allowing individuals to travel at their own pace and on their own schedules. The mass production of affordable automobiles, such as Henry Ford's Model T, made car ownership accessible to a wider range of people further diminishing the demand for horse-drawn carriages. Additionally, the development of electric trams and trolleys provided a more efficient and environmentally friendly alternative to horse-drawn carriages in urban settings. These vehicles could transport large numbers of passengers within cities without the need for horses and the associated maintenance and care they required. While the decline of horse-drawn carriages as a primary mode of transportation is evident, it's important to recognize the significant role they played in shaping the world we know today. Their impact on trade, communication, and society as a whole paved the way for the advancements in transportation that followed. As we move on to our final topic, we'll explore the preservation and continued use of horse-drawn carriages in modern times. As we reach the final topic in our exploration of horse-drawn carriages, let's investigate their preservation and continued use in modern times. Even though they are no longer a primary mode of transportation, horse-drawn carriages still hold a special place in our hearts as symbols of tradition luxury, and nostalgia. Today, they are often reserved for special occasions and tourist attractions, allowing us to experience a taste of the bygone era of elegant transportation. One of the most common uses of horse-drawn carriages in modern times is for weddings and other special events. The beautifully decorated carriage pulled by impeccably groomed horses adds a touch of romance and fairy tale charm to these occasions. Couples often choose this mode of transportation to make a grand entrance or exit, creating a memorable experience for both themselves and their guests. In addition to special events, horse-drawn carriages are also popular tourist attractions in many cities around the world. These carriages offer visitors a unique way to explore the history and charm of a city at a leisurely pace. From the historic streets of Vienna and Paris to the bustling cities of New York and San Francisco, horse-drawn carriages continue to enchant tourists with their timeless elegance. Preserving and maintaining these carriages has become a labor of love for many enthusiasts and craftsmen. The Burbison Files has a prediction of horse-drawn carriages work tirelessly and many of these vehicles remain in excellent condition. In part meant residential quality tireless of Harvard transforming. In conclusion, the preservation and continued use of horse-drawn carriages in modern times allow us to appreciate and experience the elegance and charm of a bygone era. Whether it's a romantic wedding or a leisurely tour of a historic city, these beautiful vehicles continue to captivate our imaginations and transport us to a time when life moved at a slower, 